Look, man, it's clean as a whistle, just like I told you. Nobody else here but me. I'm not asking you anymore, am I? Zip it. This is the part where you show me a warrant? I believe this is the part I knock you out. I'm gonna ask a question. And you answer just that one question, then shut the hell up. We got it. <clears throat> What's that stain? Spilled red wine. Happens all the time. Red wine, my behind. Uh, special Lady Cartwright, uh, where are you going? Don't need to, no, don't need to go back there. There's, just, there's nothing back there to see. It's just, it's just a bunch of work, new dads and whatnot. And hey, look, there's just old boxes and rotten tomatoes. So many rotten tomatoes. It's not even. You don't want to go back there. Hey. Good God. You're not gonna find anything back there. It's not a smuggling operation. Not harvesting fugitives or assassins or hit men or women. Whatever. I don't know how many times I have to tell you grocery store. Don't just try and change the subject on me. Sorry. I didn't mean diamond. I meant diamonds. Like the ones we're gonna be getting. You, you forget, as easy as it is for you to lie to other people, you can't do it to me. I see right through it. So stop and like a gentleman, hit me with the truth. What diamond are you getting? Not the kind you think I'm getting. Well, what then? You won't believe me until you see it on the news. Excuse me? It's gonna change the world. Diamonds that can heal us, boost us up, give us immunity, bring us back to life. <laughs> yeah. Well, you don't believe me, huh? Will you help me finish this job? We'll see who's laughing. You are Robert. Is that what you're making this about? Ellis, you gotta know this is just one of Harlem's crap lies to get you doing what he wants you to do. We'll see, won't we? I got you the grilled chicken instead of the fried crispy kind. Better for you. How'd you end up doing this? Oh. <laughs> I, I got mixed up with some of the wrong people. 
Same way it always goes down. Influence and something you did wrong biting you in the ass. Seems to always happen, Jay. No matter what. So you don't know why you kidnapped me? You just did it? For the money? <laughs> That's the kicker. It's only for those diamonds you gave us. You don't even know if we're gonna be able to turn it into money. You don't know that the diamonds aren't diamonds anymore? I don't think you want to tell me these diamonds are fake. Do you even know what Harlem's diamonds do? What they do? <laughs> Look, I can show you, sort of. Do you have any on you? Open the bag, take one out. What the hell did you just do? It's not drugs. Well, sort of. It's not a diamond anymore, that's for sure. Harlem was in Europe, running some test on some code name, Zero G Substance. Hasn't been fully tested yet. Well, and the test they've already run? You gotta understand, though, the effects of these things, man. They haven't been fully tested. I mean, you have no idea. Andrew! Wait here! Here, take them off our hands! Go! Holy crap. Bad move, Red. Please, uh, Andrew, giant, sir. Well, you two don't look so good. We ain't nothing compared to what I'm gonna do. Hey, hey! Get out of my way. We're not doing this. I vote to agree with the second dead guy in the room. Shut it, Red. <gasps> side of the universe or something, Andrew. A place of creation. Whatever I wanted was possible. Mm -hmm. 
Which is, it's not possible. You can't come back from death being at the point of it is, it's infinitely set. We haven't achieved it. Andrew, I was dead. I felt the life slip away from this body, only to have another regrow in its place. I know what you're thinking. <laughs> I had to pull to that life. And when I gave in, I was awake. It was death, and we lived through it. You know what that means. Would you... You can talk. Oh, oh, oh you've got to be kidding me. I advise you not to, though. Point taken. Decide where you want to be. Let's go grave robbing. <laughs> Thank you.